Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to talk today about um, the 2018 Pacific Shield exercises, and this was in the Stars and Stripes on the Stars and Stripes website. Basically, right now, the South Korean, the Japanese, and the um, U.S. Navy are uh, learning how to um, check for weapons of mass destruction aboard ships, aboard other ships. And but there are 13 Japanese sailors from the destroyer, the J.S. Murasami, or Murasame, um, had joined uh, U.S. sailors from the destroyer, the USS Milius. And, the, and then a team of South Korean sailors joined them as well, and they're learning how to search um, other ships as well as their own ships for weapons of mass destruction, um, unauthorized weapons. Um, and this is the beginning of Pacific Shield, the Exercise Pacific Shield 2018. Um, there was also an observer from the Philippine Navy that came to observe these exercises so he can see what's going on so he can you know in the future the Philippine Navy may take part in uh, learning how to search other ships for weapons of mass, mass destruction and um, after this exercise they're going to join the Philippine and the Thai navies um, for for other exercises but Pacific Shield is a 17 member um, it consists of 17 nations that are part of the United Nations um, but so right now, to kick it off, the U.S., the Japanese, and the South Korean navies have um, started learning how to, and training how to search ships for weapons of mass destruction. Basically, the United States is doing the train, most of the training, I mean, is doing most of the teaching, and then the South Korean and the Japanese navies are learning from them. So, thumbs up to all three of the navies, and I wish them all the best. I uh, hope everyone's doing well. Take care. God bless them. Bye-bye.